All right, folks, welcome to another beautiful evening here at Midway Power Sports, located in the heart of the Ozarks here in Spokane, Missouri. Just about 20 minutes south of Springfield, about 30 minutes northwest of Branson, Missouri. Folks, as you see it pictured uh, at MidwayPowerSports.com, I have 70 pictures of this 2005 Tracker Tundra 21 DC. That's dual console, 21 foot boat, all original with tons of extras. Um, original matching trailer, tan maxle, dual disc brakes on front and back. Yes, I said that right, disc brakes on front and back on each side. Folks, this is a beautiful, beautiful one owner boat. I, enough can't be said about it. I just traded it for it. Uh, uh, the original owner came in and bought another one from me. Uh, he had all the paperwork, all the books, all the manuals. Um, I know a lot of dealers will, will talk their stuff up. Of course, everybody wants to sell them. Um, for lack of a better term, this gentleman is honestly emotionally attached to this boat. He had a lot of pride in things that he owned. Um, he took excellent care of them. He, uh, I, and I even verified all the information that he told me because he was just kept going on and on. I didn't know if he was just trying to throw a sales pitch on me. But uh, to be honest with you, he was just being true to his word. Um, he stored this boat with a cover inside a local boat storage facility. Um, he said uh, uh, he's never even pulled this boat in the rain. I, you know, I don't know. You know, it gets wet on the lake, but um, just doesn't want the nasty road grime getting up on it or in the boat. Up front here, you've got your five flat plug, fold away tongue brakes of course guys I do these videos to just give you a better idea than just still photos four great tires all the way around you see here I went ahead and hooked my hose up to it we will uh, we will fire this boat for you but you can see the ground is uh, dry um, there's the bungee and the um, transom saver there three blade tempest stainless prop folks this boat is immaculate this is a 200 horsepower mercury um, i have papers on it showing that has 60.2 hours and i said that right 60.2 hours always serviced at the dealer where he bought it from which is a local dealer for uh to us Guys, you've seen all the pictures. I'm not gonna take the time, just for the sake of the video, I'm not gonna take time to open everything back up. Um, I'll do a couple here for you. I mean, this this boat is just absolutely, there's your live well. Here's a little bait well. This, this boat is in excellent, excellent condition. Um, if you notice these seats, these are not, these are factory seats. Let me clarify, these are the original seats that he bought with this boat but he did have them uh, factory upgraded. Uh, so these aren't the standard Tundra seats. Um, I think he, he said this was actually out of the sport model. Um, he just liked the style of seat better, more comfortable for his preference. And he also even changed these pedestals to the pump. If you can see that, they are upgraded. Tons of upgrades. He, he had a, this beautiful Bimini top, which is in excellent, excellent condition. He did add more speakers down there for the radio. Rod holders here on each side, which you know in the pictures you guys seen all this stuff open up. There's no rips or tears. He's a non-smoker. There's no burn holes. This this interior is just absolutely as plush and soft as can be. Um, gosh, if I just sound like I'm talking this thing up like it's brand new, because I I mean this boat is absolutely like brand new. I mean this is soft. Still feels new. Over here we've got just a storage. More storage up here. Here's your cover for the Bimini. And then in here, I guess I can go ahead and show this to you. I have the uh, iPilot owner's manual and remote. Folks, this is for the trolling motor if you've not seen these. This is a Minn Kota Tarova, if I'm saying that right. It's an iPilot, fully digital, and GPS guided. Um, if you're asking me where the foot pedal is for this, this trolling motor, it's not a foot pedal, it's right here. You clip this on your belt, 
you can actually point this where you want it to go, set it, and it'll, it'll take you there. Um, that's how you fully control it. This is a $1,200 unit that uh, brand new, it, what, which is what he paid when he purchased it to have it put on. Really, really nice trolling motor. See the other uh, uh, bait well right there. We got plenty of storage. Uh, rods, big, big rod storage down here. Guys, you've got all this stuff. You saw all the pictures when I opened all this up. I'm gonna take a look at these gauges. They are nice, crystal clear. Everything on this boat works. Guys, he, I, I can't get a, the only reason he, he cause, uh, got a boat from me is because he got a boat and he's gonna take care of it the same way he took care of this one. The only reason he was looking to go down to an 18 foot boat instead of a 21 foot boat, it was just typically him and his two kids uh, uh, and, and sometimes the wife out when they went on the lake and he goes, you know, I just don't need a 21 foot boat anymore. Um, he goes, we, he goes, I kind of overdid it when I bought this one. Uh, so uh, his change of mind is definitely your gain. That's for sure. We have small lakes down here guys. So there's no, there's here locally, there's really no need for, a, for, for, uh, you know, there are a lot of 21, 22 foot ski boats on our local lakes. Um, but if, if, if it's just you and your son going fishing, this, I sold him an uh, 18 foot fishing ski and he's going to have a blast on that. Go ahead and show you a few, few more options here. Turn on that master power. This is the Hummingbird 363 GPS fish finder. And I also do have the other one that you saw in the pictures um, that is, is not installed on the front. Uh, but I do have another um, fish finding unit to go with this that uh, can easily be mounted on the front. I have all the all the cables, all the sensors, everything there to go with it. Here's a Kenwood CD player, AM, FM. See if we can hear a little music on it. Oh. I'm getting drunk on a plane. He did, like I said, more speakers. Got the horn. All these bilges, live wells, lights, everything works 100% on this boat, folks. Just absolutely a pristine boat. Well, without further ado, guys, I'm hoping I'm showing you everything you wanna see. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and drop this motor down. I'm not down too far there. Now, I am kind of doing this by myself, so if you could bear with me, and we're not professional said making videos here, but we do uh, we do know our boats. Okay, and here's also the trim, obviously here. And if you don't mind, be a little patient with me. I'm gonna go crank on the water. And then we will do a uh, cold start on this boat. folks hopefully I can do this from standing out here see I might have to jump back in I might as well I want you guys to see how easily this boat boat starts with 60.2 hours on it Gas gauge is correct. He's got three quarters of tank in here. I guess it helps if I push the button. Be 
right there is just rev limiter. Keeps it, it keeps it at low RPM when just in neutral. Folks, if you don't mind, I'm going to set you down. I'm going to step over here and put this thing in and out of gear for you. Again, got a little water on the lens. That's when you know we're making them right. There you go, a little wipe off there. How's that computer screen look? A little bit better? This is Midway Power Sports. You can find us at MidwayPowerSports.com. See all 70 pictures. See a link to this YouTube video. Folks, this boat is available for purchase at any time. Give us a call, area code 417-443-2300. This is our 2005 Tracker Tundra DC. One owner, all original tons of extras folks 60.2 hours on this motor um, enough really can't be said about it it's a beautiful beautiful very well maintained boat all the books all the manuals everything to go with it guys you you've been boat shopping you know I'm a dealer I don't find them like this all the time I wish this is how they all were but unfortunately they're not but luckily I've got this one and if this is what you're looking for don't hesitate because uh, I'm sure your neighbor will end up with it and then uh, you'll still be looking. So, folks, I appreciate your time and we we'll hope to hear from you soon. Thanks for watching our video.